Hello everyone, welcome you all. So this is Pawan. So in this video, I'm going to explain about uh, a testing technique called boundary value analysis. So the basically boundary value analysis is uh, based on testing at the boundaries between the partitions. So which includes maximum and minimum inside or outside boundaries. So let us see how to use this uh, technique uh, uh, to test the software. So let's see a few examples here. So in this example, I have a age uh, field, so which will accept 18 to 56. It will accept 18 to 56. And now if you see here, minimum boundary is 18 and maximum boundary is 56. And if you want to, what are the valid inputs here is uh, 18 or 19, 55 and 56 are the uh, valid boundaries. Because if you see this particular table, uh, we need to consider a few parameters here. So first, uh, let's say is giving 18 to 55. Let's say 18 uh, to 55, 56. So minimum range is 18 and the maximum is a 56. This, let's say it is minimum and this is your a maximum range. So if you want to test this particular scenario, normally if I don't use this particular technique, I have to test with all the numbers between 18 to 56. Those are valid inputs and uh, more than 56 what are the values we need to verify them they are invalid and before 18 what are the values we have i need to also test them so that is also invalid so to reduce this effort uh, what we can do is we, or we can reduce these inputs by using this technique so here we'll take, let's take only uh, here three parameters and here three parameters total is seven parameter uh, six parameters we can take here let's say this is minimum and minimum minus one and minimum plus one and here maximum, maximum minus one and maximum plus one. So we are only considering as a boundaries. Okay. So if I see what is the invalid input is minimum minus one will be invalid. And uh, maximum plus one is also invalid. If I one scenario is failed here, one number is failed, uh, maximum plus one, rest of them obviously will fail. Similarly, if I n minus one, right? So that is 17 is failed. That means uh, 16, 15, everything will fail. So between 18 to 56, we can just take minimum, minimum plus one, maximum, maximum minus one. So only we'll consider these are uh, input test data. So this is the boundary value analysis. So here the valid inputs are 18, 19, 56 and 56. So this is enough to complete, uh, this, enough, yeah, this is enough to test the complete scenario. And what are the invalid inputs? 17 and uh, 57 is a uh, invalid input. Now we can write uh, six different test cases here now. So enter the valid value 17, that is a uh, minimum minus one, it is invalid. And enter the value of 18, this is a uh, minimum value, this is valid. And enter the value 19, this is a minimum plus one, this is also valid. And uh, enter the value 55, that means uh, maximum minus one, this is also valid. And 56 is a maximum value, that is also valid and uh, enter the value of 57 that means uh, maximum plus one is invalid so this will cover the complete uh, uh, scenario so this is the one of the example of uh, boundary value analysis technique now let's see one more example so here i have a text box uh, which will accept uh, 6 to uh, 12 characters this is basically uh, a range Boundary value always, always uh, boundary value analysis technique always uh, talk about uh, range. So here, uh, this text box will accept uh, six to twelve characters. So minimum is six, maximum is twelve character. So to test this, uh, we have a uh, boundaries like this. Let's say uh, this is six minimum and uh, twelve is a maximum. So six minus one, five. Six plus one, seven and 12 minus 1 is 11, 12 plus 1 is uh, 30. So if it has only these uh, values, there is more enough. So 6 and 7 are valid, and here 11 and 12 are valid, and uh, 5 is invalid, and here 13 is invalid. So if you test this scenario with these uh, boundary values, so that is more than enough. That will cover the entire function. So here minimum boundary is 6, and maximum mode is 12. So valid uh, text length is six characters, seven characters, 11 characters, and 12 characters. These are all valid. And if I say five and 13 characters, they are invalid. So we can write six number of test cases here. So let's say five, enter the text uh, which contains five characters, that is minimum minus one is invalid. And uh, enter the text uh, 
which length is uh, 6 exactly that minimum is valid and enter characters uh, which length is 7 that means minimum plus 1 is valid and enter the length of letters like 11 characters that is maximum minus 1 is also valid and uh, enter the text uh, which uh, length is 12 that is ma maximum that is also valid and the last one enter the characters with uh, 13 characters that is maximum plus 1 that is also invalid so this will cover these test cases will cover everything on that particular scenario so that's all about boundary value analysis technique so thanks for watching this video so please subscribe my channel to get more updates on this thank you all